All right, right now it's the last day. Today is the last day before the full lockdown, before they apply the super strict measures starting tomorrow where nobody will be allowed to get out of their house, uh, not, even, not even to buy food. So there's only a few hours left until this, until the curfew is on and until those uh, restrictions are, are fully applied. And so it's kind of the last minute rush to buy food. I bought most of the food I need yesterday, but I still need a few things. So I thought I would take you with me and show you what it looks on that crazy last minute rush to buy all the goods you need before you can't get out. All right, let's go. See, most uh, residential areas are kind of uh, uh, isolated this way. But uh, yesterday and today, the streets have been more busy than they've been in the past few weeks because uh, like it's like uh, time, it's like if the shopping time slots that we're given don't really matter now because everybody is out to get whatever they can so they can uh, <laughs> feed themselves and their family for the next uh, week or so. It might be more, so I think people are kind of uh, going a bit nuts and making sure they have everything. Well, you see, this area is locked off. There's only one access on the left, and it's at the next street. And there's like a police checkpoint to make sure well, most of the time, they make sure that whoever enters that area is allowed to go to go there to go shopping. But today might be a little bit free for all. I'm not sure. Yeah, they opened the gate wide, and uh, the only uh, the only police officer or security guy was sitting there. So I think today might be a little bit free for all where everybody's allowed to go wherever to get what they can get to feed themselves for the next week or more. A lot of uh, people are lining up outside trying to get what they can. A lot of the supermarkets are out of a lot of products, not much left. feels actually less busy than yesterday. Maybe uh, most people uh, thought about getting their food a couple of days as soon as they heard the news, you know, like uh, two days ago and yesterday before nothing is left. This shop yesterday was full of uh, veggies, but they have nothing now. And some people set their little carts like this on the street to sell veggies and meat as most stores uh, ran out especially when it comes to fresh goods like uh, vegetables and fruits
People were lining up yesterday in front of that shop here, that green shop that sells uh, mostly rice. And next door here you have fish and seafood. It seems uh, a lot more quiet today. Maybe it's because, uh, as I said, maybe most people were able to get what they needed uh, in the previous two days. Uh, they announced, sorry about the wind, they announced uh, those uh, new measures uh, two days ago. It's much quieter today. I mean, there's still people out getting whatever they can during this last day, last few hours actually. All right, doesn't uh, there's uh, there's nothing else further. There's nothing else further down this road. So just gonna go back. we can find here. Uh, almost nothing left. Especially when the, with the fresh goods. A few fish heads. A little bit of meat left but not much. Uh, okay, there's still, still some dry goods like instant noodles, but stocks are low, but there's still some. What I need is water. Normally, I get those really really big bottles of water like 18 liters delivered to my place but uh, they were out of water so I'm trying to see if I can find like some uh, six liter jugs I don't see any here you can't drink tap water here so uh, Bottled water is uh, an essential need, an essential product. I mean, you can always boil water, but it's not ideal because it doesn't get rid of the, the heavy metals that may be contained in the water. Uh, by the way, uh, Nuxui Chai Long. Nuxui, but the big one. The Shaolit, Shaolit. Oh, you might have some here. Thùng này 4 chai á Thôi đi xe đạp Xe đạp bỏ bao Bỏ bao treo được mà Ok ok Hai chai chai Two bottles better than nothing Oh ok Trời bỏ ba lô được Lấy hết thùng luôn không Maybe two Ok Ok I will come back
À, xin lỗi, bao nhiêu thế? 37 ừ? 37 37 ờ, 56, I take F7 Chào mọi, chào mọi Rồi, cảm ơn Oh. All right, I got 10 liters. That should be that should be enough for a few days. I might do a second run to get 10 more liters. I can't carry more on my bicycle. But you see here, people are lining up at this uh, market. They're letting people, a few people at the time, to avoid a crowded, small indoor space. Yeah, it's a lot less. Uh, it's a lot less hectic than yesterday. Uh, I did my uh, shopping yesterday and I live streamed it, so I will include some footage uh, right here to give you an idea. Cooking in the kitchen with all of my friends and everyone is happy. All right, you gotta zigzag a bit. People are going crazy. Traffic is nuts. Whoa, come on, dude. Yeah, I can feel the panic is in the air. Like it's, it's like now, now it's time. So yeah, as you can see, it's much less hectic today, much quieter. I mean, it's still busy, but I feel like people got whatever they could mostly yesterday and maybe the day before. Yesterday there was a full lineup here to go inside of this uh, small supermarket. All right, so that's it. This was a, a small tour of the shopping area that I have access to on the last day, the last few hours before the full lockdown. Uh, less, much less hectic than it was yesterday. I hope you found this interesting and I'll catch you in the next one.